Arco Control is an easy-to-use software to test recloser and sectionalizer controls. In this tutorial, you will learn how to configure the Arco 400 hardware and how to step through the software's workflow-guided process. For this example, we will set up the test for a Cooper 26-pin recloser control. Before testing can begin, the Arco test set must be associated with the PC or tablet being used. The offline demo mode can be used without connecting to an Arco. However, in this mode, the Arco control software will not control the test set. On startup, you will notice two modes for testing, the test plan mode and the manual mode. Select Test Plan Mode to execute test plans already created with the Rico Plan software. The Test Plan Mode is only available if your Arco 400 is equipped with this option. In this tutorial, we will use the Manual Mode. The Test Plan Mode will be explained in further detail in a separate video. After selecting the Manual Mode, the test adapter connected to the test set will automatically be recognized by the software. Now you can select the recloser control model that is going to be tested. If the recloser control you are testing is not listed, please select the Other option. If this adapter will only be used to test this specific model of recloser control, you can select the Save Configuration option. This remembers the controller model for future uses of this adapter and skips the controller selection page. Select the Apply button to move on to the next screen. Based on the adapter and controller selection, the majority of parameters within the hardware configuration are set to predefined values. In the Report Information window, you can fill in the general information. This will then appear in your test report. The controller information is automatically added in the appropriate fields. If required, you can adjust the settings for the analog outputs of the Arco to match your specific application. If the recloser control which is being tested has a phase rotation that differs from the default settings of A, B, and C, you can change the phase rotation in the Phase Connection window. In this field, the system frequency can be defined. The Voltage Settings section allows you to configure the primary and secondary voltages. The primary line-to-line -line V nominal selection may vary depending on your specific system voltage configuration. ARCO 400 has two three-phase voltage outputs available, one labeled with A and the other with B. Each three-phase amplifier can operate on either an 8-volt range or a 150-volt range. Please note that only the voltage options ordered with the ARCO 400 will be displayed for selection. Caution needs to be applied when selecting voltages to make sure that the appropriate amplifier is selected for the corresponding voltage input. Otherwise, you might apply voltage through the incorrect amplifier output and damage the recloser control. If in doubt, always check the adapter manual or verify it with the recloser control manufacturer. In some instances, the secondary voltage may be different for source and load depending on the manufacturer's specifications and model number. As an example, if you are testing a setup with an external 120 volt potential transformer on the source side and an integrated three phase capacitive voltage divider on the load side, you need to set the voltage amplifier A to the 150 volt range with the respective ratio. And voltage amplifier B to the 8 volt range with a 10 kV to 1 volt ratio.
In the current output settings, you can change the CT ratio, the maximum current output, and the CT star point connection. The load current setting will be used as three phase pre fault condition during the execution of the tests. To make sure your controller doesn't trip during the pre fault state, set this load current to a value below your minimum phase pickup setting. On the right, you can see the breaker simulation. The binary outputs of ARCO 400 simulate the recloser 52A and B contact status. You can change the simulated position of the switch in the breaker control diagram. When you are doing this, you will also see the changed status on the ARCO front panel. If supported by your test adapter, you can also change the position of the yellow handle. Select the Apply button to move on to the Test Tools window.